Hey guys, welcome back to another video. In this video, we are going to take a look how we can create aim offset inside Unreal Engine. So, let's get started. If I hit play and keep my weapon, I have my shooting mechanic and all that good stuff. But, uh, as you can see, if I drag my, my mouse into the sky, my arm and my weapon will stay in the in this position. They they will not uh, rot rotate along my view. If I look down, um, yeah, nothing really happened because uh, we need aim offset. And yeah, let's get started. In the anime starter pack, they include this uh, any aim space iron side, which is. Uh, all the animation that we need we only need one single frame animation so uh, let me create a new folder right here i call it aim and uh, yeah so let me duplicate this one copy here I'm gonna pause this enemies. Just drag this uh, timeline to the center. We, go, we are going to call this center. So, let me first uh, duplicate this one because uh, I have to duplicate this uh, several times. I'm gonna call it CC, I mean center. And let me. So, drag your timeline to the start of this uh, timeline, right click, remove, uh, remove uh, from 0 to 72, I'm um, sorry, it's done on stage, oh uh, yeah, uh, remove from uh, 1 to 87 uh, if i hit play now we have one single frame animation this is going to be our mm, going to be our center animation now i'm gonna duplicate this one again i'm gonna call it center up let me find uh, this is my up. Um, click right here. We are going to remove from 0 to 9. And from here, remove from 1 to 78. And save this one. Now, let's duplicate this one again. I'm gonna call that center down. Let me find the center down. Yeah, there we go. This is our center down. I'm gonna right click here, remove uh, from 0 to 20, and from there, remove uh, from 1 to 68. Save this one. Now we have our main. Our aim, our main space. Let's create a right space. So, duplicate this one again. Call it R, C, which means right center. And uh, let me find the right center. And this is our right center. Remove from, click in the red button. Remove from 0 to 30. And from there, remove from 1 to so save this one duplicate it again call it so R in S center right up so let's find the center up yeah this is center up remove from 0 to 4 and remove from 
one, two, four, three, eight. Let me do we get this one again. Center, right, down. For the center right now, I'm gonna find the uh, right. Yeah. There we go. Again, be doing your uh, all that stuff we got here. Save this one. Now we have our center, our right, but we need uh, three more. These are left. So let's create the left. Duplicate this one. Center to left. For the left, this is our center. Left. Remove the unnecessary frames. And save. Copy this one again. Center L R. This is going to be a left up. And, uh, yeah. So, and one more. This is going to be center L down. So let me find the center down, I mean center left down, remove all of the unnecessary frames, go as this one, and save. Now we have all the animation, but we have to edit them uh, for additive uh, animation. So what I'm gonna do is to select this one, hold down shift, right click, um let me yeah we have asset action here um click on the bulk bulk edit we are property matrix for the additive setting we are going to mesh a space and selected animation frame for the base pose animation we have to select our uh for idol, we find the idol. Let's find the idol rifle uh, rifle iron set. Select uh, in, yeah. Select this one. Click on the use selected asset from content browser, and make sure to save all. There we go. So we have to let me find in this folder again. Right click. In the animation section, uh, we have two type of anim offset. Uh, one anim offset uh, that we are going to use use it. This uh, this is uh, much similar to uh, blend space, and also we have uh, aim offset one D that much more similar to blend space one D. So they are they are kind of same. They are kind of the same thing, but these are anim offset and these are blend the space so let me create the aim offset and choose the right skeleton yeah so i'm gonna call it aim dot ao so for this one we have all the animation right here so for the center Put the center right here and for, uh, we have our editive uh, editive animation yeah here yeah. but we have a horizontal axis and the vertical axis this is going to be this one going to be our pitch for the minimum axis value I'm gonna call it minus 90, 90 and for this one 90 and also for this one minus 90 90 there we go so let's set up our aim offset i've dragged the center in the middle of the screen center down here and 
there's a center off yeah center off if i hold my shift down um like my mouse you see we have this aim offset and for the center left center center or down center off right center I think it's going to left uh, up and side of the down. So let's see what we create. And we kind of ready to go. Save everything. Uh, open your animation blueprint. That's in my animation, I guess. <laughs> yeah. This is our our animation blueprint so in the anim blender space i'm gonna put it right here because i don't want to uh, while we haven't equipped the weapon use this blender space so i'm gonna put it right in the rifle blender space i mean rif rifle state i'm sorry and drag this aim under underscore ao right here like this one look it up for the yaw, I'm gonna promote this one to a variable. Which, yeah, promote this two to a new variable. So, let me open the event graph. We already have this uh, actor rotation, so I'm gonna call get control. Get control rotation. For the get control rotation, I'm gonna search for delta rotator this is going to be B for this one I'm gonna have to have to I'm gonna make it make a rotator and for the yaw I'm gonna put the yaw and for the delta time I'm gonna promote uh, this one to a variable and let me get to delta time and in trip speed uh, I'm gonna I'll let uh, like this one for two minutes <laughs> and for return value i'm gonna break break a rotator for the break rotator for the yaw i'm gonna clamp angle and copy this one Pop this up these are going all going to be the same minus 90 90 and also right here minus 90 and 90 for this one i'm gonna set pitch right here i'm gonna set yaw connect pitch to the connect return value to the pitch and connect yaw to the yaw compile and i think we ready to go we've done everything right yes so let's test it out Bye. now as you can see we have the aim offset yeah but as you notice uh, our hand is not uh is, uh, is not staying where the weapon where it, where it should be so don't worry we will uh, use a hand ak we will fix it on the later on on the next video um i think yeah that's it for this video i hope you guys uh, find this video helpful if you did don't forget to like the video and subscribe to my channel for more unreal engine tutorial and i see you in the next one bye